I can't waste 12 cards. I haven't got any cards. I haven't been using, I haven't been grabbing. I have. Why am I low on cards? Oh well, whatever. Uh, last time we did the beginning of the game. Now we're doing the middle part of the game. That's not at all accurate at all. But I do know that there's one open area somewhere around here. This is not it. Um, but no, we did basically all the early levels that you would have expected to see if you ever watch like any Nintendo E3 stuff. This is the one we haven't done, and it's got two stars. Okay, noted. I'm also going to open this on my screen over here. Where's my mouse? There you are. Lovely. No echo. Beautiful. Let's get playing. How did I have the mic set up before? Was it like that? No. Because I'm like this. Ah, it's not a giant issue if this is in the way, is it? Um, you can't see me, right? It's cropped the top, hasn't it? Has this thing cropped the top of my head? I think it might have done. I can't tell because every time I look it changes. Why am I cropped? I'm gonna quickly fix that, don't mind me. Let's just stare at the lovely yellow while I realize that my whole face is incorrect. Good fun. Or maybe it's not. Um, again, another thing I'll be cropping out of the YouTube version. There is only... No, no. There is a, a Twitch version. This is the Twitch version. Never mind. Ignore me. No. Okay. Well then, can I just... There we go. That'll fix the problem. <laughs> problem solved. Easy. Now I look more like a face. And you can see a little bit more of my background and how <laughs> lackluster it is. I added a thing in the back and I'll be sticking that up eventually, officially at some point, but oh well. Uh, I did say thanks, didn't I, Blinded Smoker? Hope so, because I am thankful, I swear. And Sped, hello, you exist. Welcome, congratulations for existing, I do appreciate it. Again, I'm looking at myself rather than looking at the camera. Excuse me, I'm still new with this. Right, let's play and try and direct myself actually into the microphone. But then I can't see the game. How did I do this before? Well, for a start, you were on the other side of the mic. That is terrible. Is it just the angle on this is wrong? There you go, have a look at my drinks. You still can't see me. God damn it. What is wrong? What did I do? Heard it her. I can do that, and then I lean forward a lot, and then I just have this follow me. I guess. I need to make this lean more forwards. But then it's in the way. I don't know. I don't know. What about if you do this dumb, harsh angle over here on my mug? That it's not stable. Okay. Great. I could do half a face cam. This is fine. I'm visible. The game is not. I guess we'll just go halfway. You don't really mind? It seems like... Okay. Look at all the purple. It's beautiful. Oh, uh, well, you're purple. Okay, I was gonna say. This is this game is not purple. Right, alright. Let's play. I can play enough like this. I have to do a bit of waving. It's all cool. Sorry for the delay. Hello, Toad. I... Gotta remember my toad voice again. <clears throat> Welcome to Daffodil Peak! I just had coke, so that didn't come out very well on my thro throat <clears throat> and voice. <clears throat> Welcome to Daffodil Peak, home of the legendary Mountain Sage. Uh, Mountain Sage? That's one of those guys who knows everything, right? I'm doing this guy's voice because it's easy. I don't actually think that's how he sounds. I kind of want him to have a different voice for every color he shows, but oh well. Amazing, did you hear that, Mario? This guy's really a wise old sage, he must know where to find the paint stars. Let's climb this mountain and meet the mountain sage. Cool idea, but you'll need a climbing permit before I can let you climb the mountain. Head through the gate to your right and buy a permit from the park ranger. You'll find him in his cabin. Here, yeah, open the gate. I'll open the gate. Is that how I did the voice? I've already forgotten. And also, you, you, you can't see me. Like, my face is hidden away from this giant freaking microphone. That's better. That's worse. I mean, I could untouch. You know what? Let's try this. Because it's the bane of my actual existence. 
How would I know the game's colour? I am not colour blind that I see grayscale. I just see everything faded. The saturation is turned down. Which is the complete opposite of my capture device, which has currently got the saturation boosted so it looks even better on stream. Right, I can't see myself thanks to another dumb advert on this free app. Why don't I just do that? Does the, does the audio quality sound terrible now? I imagine it probably sounds awfully echoey because I just got rid of all of this. Unless like I put it in half-arsed somewhere. Like if I make it float. I don't know how I can do this. Or like that, that's just leaning against my monitor. That's just a hazard. There you go. Now it's resting at the bottom. I don't think that makes any in, any impact. It is, it is in the way again. <laughs> I cannot fix. Hello, Meep. You missed the last stream. You basically just missed the tutorial and the intro and everything you ever saw in trailers or uh, Nintendo at E3. Can someone tell me how the audio quality is now that I have no walls? It sounds perfectly fine. I might play with it and then change my mind later, like next time I do a stream. But at least this way you can see me and I can see all three screens. This is amazing. You can't tell in my facial expressions, but this is amazing. Okay. I'm gonna leave that there. Sounds fine to me, but it sounds the same to me, so what do I know? Audio isn't as amazing as that hat. I'm afraid I can't keep it there, it doesn't balance at all. But, let's play the game with all my newfound light visuals. Like, all the screens are blaring at me, this is great. <laughs> I'll take that, and I can lean it to aim more at me. Ah, oh, wonderful. There is no reason for this paint. All right, you. Jesus. You're not gonna miss this stream, says Meep. Well, good stuff, I guess. Though I'm, I already know what to expect at this point. It's all new to you and less new to me. Well, actually, I guess everything from this point is new to me now, but still, we'll see. Hmm, what guy, what's with this place? Mood seems kind of gloomy. Isn't this the park ranger that, that the gatekeeper mentioned? Maybe he's one of those emo types. Okay. Need a climbing permit? Uh, yes sir! We'd like to climb Davido Peak and meet the Mountain Sage. I might change his voice, it's kind of jarring that he's so wrong. Yeah, look, I'm sorry, but I'm not really in the mood. My cabin is a wreck. Vandals broke in and drained the color everywhere. I'm too depressed to do my job. I don't know how, what that s text sound is supposed to sound like though. You finished the game an hour ago. Fair enough, Hazard. Also, hello. Um. We understand. These coloured spots are a real downer. I'd be depressed too. But Mario, this guy is really bringing me down. Think we could fix his pace up a bit? Sure. I've been actually skipping most of the paint spots because they're optional and I don't have the patience to perfectly hit each little spot. So, uh... <laughs> A little skeptical on doing it myself now, but I guess now it's not optional. I'll do it, sure. But all right, come on, you. Can you get out of the way somehow? I don't know how to flip this. I'll get to it in a bit. Like, look at look at all this precision needed on this giant splodge. It's just not fun. Like, this takes multiple, and it's just one bigger splodge. This feels like Luigi's Mansion actually at the moment. Maybe because it's just indoors. Like, what What do here? Clearly a puzzle. Just hit nearby. Yes, it was just hit nearby. I clearly hit orange, but okay. Oh. These guys are extensive. Why'd they shut all the splodges again? Feels like there's still something wrong. Just a little more. Please do something. Is it the actual door? It was not the actual door. Is it the chandelier? Is that, is that what this is trying to tell me? Hit the toad. I, I don't know. 
Already I'm bored of the, of the actual painting part. Okay, that was the answer. But like... I mean, if you mean this actual block is one, it is not. I am already stuck. Also, hello, Shadow White. Thank you for joining us. Anybody else I see? No. I'm also a bit behind on the actual chat. Do excuse me. Actually distracted with actual puzzles. So wait, you stuck? Why have you stuck on the wall? Just bad luck, I guess. Maybe. Okay, so clearly it is the chandelier in some form. Oh, is it one of these? It's not one of these, is it? I mean, that thing's kind of got a circle there. No, no, it's not. <sighs> Actually, you do open. No. You're also standing on a little blotch. Like, the floor does not finish around you. It's a slot underneath you. Is that relevant? Oh, for God's sake. Okay. Oh crap, this is an unfurl block. What's an unfurl block? Hitting an unfurl block grants you the power to unfurl certain objects, but only for a limited time. While you unfurl your power while your unfurl power is active, just hammer things that bear the unfurl mark too. Unfurl them! Okay, so the thing he's sitting on. Gotta figure then. Wasn't there something with this same mark inside the cabin? This is a weird mechanic, and I'm not sure I like it, but okay. Ah, this is my favorite chair! Somehow I must have got folded into a plain old box! Nice unfurling, Mario. But they must have also drained the color from it. What a shame. It was my favorite chair ever. Ever. God damn it. I always use the wrong B's and TH's. Done it for years. Oh, it is Luigi's Mansion. Lights up and everything. Whoa! My cabin! I can't believe it! <coughs> Mario! You fixed- How do you do a posh toad? <laughs> Mario! You fixed my place! Thanks so much! My heart and my cabin are back to their bright, happy selves! And as a thank you, here! Just sounds like more toad. Oh! And the blip was relevant. Take this climbing permit. They'll usually run you a pretty penny, but this one's on the house, so to speak. Is this made of our flesh? You got the mountain climate permit, which was way too long as a title. Wonderful, thanks, sir. Glad we could help. I actually feel a little better, too. Well, great. Is there anything more out here? No more secrets? I was expecting more secrets. I guess not. Thanks again! Enjoy your climb and take care! Okay. Don't worry about being less active, Shadow White. It's all cool. I've been less active too. I was away for a month. I'll, I'll, I'll allow it, you know? And like things like this will be on YouTube. So you can miss it in multiple ways, but you know, you've got multiple opportunities to not miss it, is what I'm saying. If that made any sense. I did not phrase that poorly well at all. Ah, you got a climbing permit. I'm a bit surprised you got one, considering the path ranger has been rather down in the dumps. Anyway, let me start my spiel over. <clears throat> Help me remember helps me remember my lines. <clears throat> Welcome to Daffodal Peak, home of the legendary mountain sage. You'll find the sage at the peak of the mountain. Alright, I'll open the mountain path. My voice is a little Throwing off. Effer, I'm glad to hear I'm your favorite streamer. I will be streaming a lot more soon. Like in a week, I'm going to be streaming all the time. So, um, look forward to that. Have a good climb, Mario. And by climb, you mean just swirl into a pipe. Well, actually, he just walked in that time and curved. Interesting. Right, so another thing I've been doing this series if you do not know and haven't caught up, is I've just kind of been skipping battles. And I say that by jumping on a card because I thought it wasn't actually near the guy. Depth perception, yay! 
I don't have many cards. And also, the whole thing is shown on this little gamepad, which is dumb to me. And also, I barely have any actual attacking cards, so I'm gonna skip. Um, but no, when you fight, there's no experience in this game. The things you can earn are paint and hammers that upgrade the amount of paint you get. But you use paint to light the cards, like to, to colour in the cards that you use. So what I'm gonna do is not get in fights in the hopes that I don't use the paint, so then I don't need to use the extra paint that I would get from the fights. I could be super wrong. There are some that are mandatory. I feel like fighting this guy in the darkness was somehow predestined. Just a hint. <laughs> Didn't even see the land that he was in, but I guess it was just more darkness. Was he in the pipe? Also, I can't pay attention to his funny quips because I can't see him. Oh yes, I gotta press the A button. I forget about this. But, oh well. I'll do some fights, the mandatory ones, but otherwise I'm just kinda gonna skip. Oh wow, it was a mandatory pipe fight. That's quite cool. I appreciate that. And also it doesn't seem like there's a giant amount of hammers needed to upgrade, though maybe it's because we're still on the early upgrades, so I'm happy to just do it occasionally. Thank you. Hmm. Okay, so there's another path around there, it looked like. Jesus, what is... what? Okay, there's a lot going on. Hello, Toad. What a surprise, there's another one. Oh, what's your deal? I fell off a cliff and creased my leg. It's pretty bad. Also, hello, Blinded Smoker, with two points. Here are the talking pink can colours. Emotion... Em color emotions. Red anger, yellow happy, blue sad, purple depressed, orange dancey, green shy. Those are the color emotions for talking paint can thing. Okay, fair enough. I will pay attention to that. I can see colors, you know, and I can read emotions. Generally, but okay. That's cool. Alright, let's see if we can help him. Oh, that actually worked. Ow, that wasn't my leg. <laughs> no, okay. Oh, Mario, you fixed my leg. Thanks. Tower number one of the Purple Rescue Squad, reporting for duty. Since I've been separated from my captain, I'll report back to Port Prisma HQ until further notice. It's gonna be one of these, huh? Okay, there's totally more secrets. Like, it looked like there was another floor here, but I guess not. That way. But actually, that's not really a secret, is it? No. Never mind. Excuse me and my my poor lack of thinking. And there's nothing there? That's another pipe there. Does that go somewhere special? Maybe? Have we gone through that? We haven't gone through that, have we? Where is this? Not where I want to be is where this is. Good lord, there's a lot going on here. Okay, yes, that's where we came before. Excuse me and my arrogance. I will move on now. Sorry, half trying to pay attention to the chat. It's hard to do. I've also discovered how sensitive my mic is, that the moment I'm away even slightly is the moment that you can't hear anything, or it seems to be the case. Jesus, that's a long dive they've got. How about no? I just don't have the ability to fight you, really. I don't want to. I could do a battle spin, spend 10 coins to basically buy a card, but I'd rather not. Do not have that kind of investment in me. Investment in mo motivations. Right, so we're on the search for toads then, is what this basically means. The entire rescue squad of the purple variant are unabout. That's cool though. Okay, so we're going to have to do more unfurling. That's the gimmick here, huh? Can do. I do not know this song, clearly. Even though we got the soundtrack, or most of it. Oh well. Wow, it's a blaze hammer. I guess I'm going to get one for every new one I find. That makes sense. Never mind. I'm also using my opportunity to talk as much as I can because of copyrighted music. 
I already have uploaded the first episode on YouTube, if you are curious to know, and that thing wasn't actually as badly copyrighted as I thought. It was only the opening cutscene. That worked by pure luck. I, I was just doing that for fun. Um, but no, the first only thing that was copyrighted was the first cutscene, which I just cut through in editing, and it was fine. Okay, thank you, Huey. Is this, so is it going to be the Paper Mario like Thousand Year Door effect? Ah, that's uh, fairly okay. Hello, Magic Cooper. Is that foreshadowing or was I supposed to get hit by him? Probably not. Alrighty, let's go. Yes, it is. Mandatory fight. I'll do this one. Ah, Mario! I didn't expect to see you here! I'd love to stick around and s That's it, this is just more Toad. <laughs> I'd love to stick around and sweep the floor with you, but I've got places to be, lives to ruin. You know how it is for us bigwigs. But I suppose I could leave you with a little taste of M M Koopa magics. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna get super big or something soon. Oh, no battle cards. He's appeared on the bottom screen. And I can swoop through this easily. No, I can't because my headphones are mixed up in the head in the microphone. There you are. Also, let me put my drinks somewhere safer so that I'm not going to knock them over. Don't mind me. Also, I saw some bits. What was that? Effers with four bits. Everyone watching Daz, I have excellent day. I imagine that's. I hope you have an excellent day. Thank you, Effers. Okay, my. I can't charge this thing at the same time. Wow, there he is. Don't know what he's saying, because I cannot read. What's he done? I don't know what he said, but I'm sure it was really important. Okay, that's it. He turned all the stickers into bad boots. What a disaster. In case you didn't know, you have to press a button five times if you want to use a single move. It's very bad. Oh well. Why is there a Goomba here? It doesn't make logical sense. Oh well. I pressed B thinking it was Thousand Year Door. Also, this is probably actually using whatever cards up front, which is mostly hammers, so I guess that's not terribly bad, but still. Let's not use my fan, huh? I've lost my, my blaze hammer by now, surely. Ah, what do I know? Right, what I want to do is I want to go down here. For this guy. Okay, blue door it is. I have no idea how this works. Can I open it three times? Guess not. Flipping cards! Hit a card with your hammer to flip it. Try and find all the pairs before the time runs out. Do we at least get to see the thi- oh, This is the worst kind of pair mini game because you can't actually tell. There's no hints. This sucks. I don't think we- No, we didn't see one of those yet. Maybe we did. Oh, what? Dude! What kind of logic is this game? This sucks. Oh, and the last one you get is the one you... That was a poorly explained game. That sucked. And is it gone now? Dude. Get another paint star first. Jesus. Harsh, but okay. I did not appreciate that in any form. Also, I'm missing a lot of things, I think. No? How do you host Blinded Smoker? I think you just put forward slash host. But I could be wrong. I don't know how to do it myself. I'm I, I'm not much of a Twitch viewer. I usually watch their stuff later on YouTube when people do that. I apologize. I'm a numpty. Okay. Well, there's my stars. That one's going to take me way back there to unfurl. Where do I want to unfurl something? I'll go this way then, I guess. Well, I'll go over here first. and No, because I don't know what I, there is to unfurl. 
Though I do like actually these these fights in the darkness. Can I flee? I cannot flee. Okay, cool. Good to know though. Right. Any easy jumping moves? Nope, absolutely none. Off you go. <laughs> maybe I'll use that as one of my thumbnails of like embrace the darkness. I don't know, maybe not. Sounds kind of dumb. What do I know? No! <sighs> so there's nothing to unfurl at the moment, so I'm not going to make that risk. Okay, so they switch over, which is great and all. There's no benefit here apart from the question mark block, so avoid paratroopers as best as possible. Oh, we got stuck on nothing anyway. It's all cool. Uh, you did backslash host, Blind Smoker. You need to do forward slash. I think. I still could be wrong. But thank you for believing me. Get out of here, you. You to be unfurled? Are you the unfurly thing? You are the unfurly thing. Noted. These paratroopers are weird. Okie dokie. Simple puzzle. Give it, please. I'm not going to bother with the three coins. Even though I tried to earlier. I just realised I could just run straight for that star on the right, but oh well. I guess the coins are supposed to teach you that? Makes sense. Oh wow, we're actually low on time. I'm impressed. Dude! Is it because it's not coloured in? Like, come on! That's dumb as heck, and I also kept hitting it! You can't host. That's a shame. Uh, I have no idea. Oh, there's an uns- um, Yes, great, I'm glad that was discovered. That dude's a cardboard cutout. What's going on with that toad up there? I'm so lost! There's so many things to to acknowledge right now. I'll get to it in a moment, but first I'm, I'm giving up on this unfurling thing. I'm guessing that actually takes you to the yellow paint star, maybe? This is some weird level design. Especially because I have to go all the way back to get the other one now. Oh, I can get the door now, actually. That'd be cool. Everything is weird right now. Also, I need to make some emotes. I'll get around to it. I've got a lot of things I plan to do. Was that actually a new level, or did I just waste my time? <laughs> I mean, I was going to anyway. Yes, I was wasting my time. Oh well. Back we go. To Daffodil Peak. Sounds like Daffodil Park. And that's what it, I don't know what that makes me think of. I don't know what kind of park would be a Daffodil Park, but oh well. Toad, hello. Have a good time, Mario. Oh, I just completely wasted my own time. Have a good time, Mario. Blighted Smoker, I have no idea how to. People have been able to host all other streams, so you must be messing up. Maybe. In fact, you didn't try the other way. I gave you a backslash. You, uh, you did a backsplash. Backsplash. Let's phrase this again. You did backslash host. It's got to be forward slash host. You are the one who is mistaken. I am wrong with the depth perception of this place. And I do not wish to. <laughs> Why bother? No thank you, please. Get out of my face. Ah, oh, Christ. What kind of fight move was that? Thank you. Actually, I could probably farm cards by doing this, but oh well. 
Also, completely missed the bits from four minutes ago. Hello, Mario Mario with 15 bits. Oof, Kamek in Sticker Star was easily the worst part of that game. You had to use sandals the entire time you had to fight him. And some th sometimes RNG was the only way to get him to come back into sandal range. Um, because he would sometimes camp up in the air where you couldn't reach him. This made the second to last fight in the game impossibly hard to beat. And that's assuming you brought the stickers you needed to beat Bowser later on. Is he any better in this game, Daz? I don't know, that was the first time we saw him and he basically did the same thing, but the, with the sandal being a little less effective. I completely forgot the door. I'm going to the door. <laughs>